Hey guys, it's only me. Uh, I thought I'd come out in the backyard today into the cubby house and um, make a video. Um, just give you a quick look around. I've got the chimney going because it's quite a cold day today. So I sparked that up for the first time in oh, 12 months probably. Um, but anyway, what the, what I wanted to do on this video was um, I've been considering going bush for a little while, maybe going off grid for a little while and um, thought what sort of tools do I need uh, to do that successfully uh, what would I need and uh, obviously a machete um, you know other tools that I would take with me uh, to go out there for a little while but I thought about self-defense against any um, any wild animals if I come across a bear or some other creature out there that I'd be able to defend myself and one of the things I considered buying was a, a nice spear um, but uh, in looking around at the price of spears there were more than I wanted to pay um, some of them were quite expensive but others were still just more than I wanted to pay um, so rather than do that um, I've gone and bought this cold steel knife <coughs> Excuse me. Um, cold steel Bushman comes with that little fire steel in the top of the sheath there. Uh, plastic sheath, a Secure X, um, and it can be turned into a spear. Uh, I meant to go to Bunnings and buy a broom handle or something, uh, but didn't get around to it. So I'm just using an old walking stick that I've had laying around the house for years. Um, that I think should fit in there okay. Uh, the other thing I bought from Condor Knives is this little um, fish and frog spear. Uh, little sheets on it. And I'll put that together too and see if I can't make that into something useful. So the chimney is really fired up now. That's probably leaping a good two and a half, three feet off the top of the top of the stack there. <coughs> and just starting to get a little bit of rain. Alright, so just give me a minute to set up the camera and um, I'll show you what I'm gonna do. Okay, so to give you a little bit closer up look of the knife. Um, like all cold steel knives, this comes razor sharp out of the box. I've never bought a cold steel knife that wasn't razor sharp. It has a little hole in the stem here so you can put a screw in it into the uh, broomstick or walking stick, whatever you're using. Uh, this does come in two blade types. Uh, the other one was a much broader blade uh, and sort of a weird shape. I thought this would be better for um, piercing and just a thinner profile um, so yeah I'm gonna set that up now and talk about it a little bit more okay so as it turned out uh, that walking stick was a perfect fit um, goes up to about here into the sleeve there uh, I'll put a screw into that and probably make that be permanent handle unless it gets broken or something um, so yeah, really happy with the way that's turned out, and I think it'd be an ideal um, spear for uh, self-defense out in the bush against wild animals and things. On the other hand, the condor fish spear here looks like it's going to be a little bit awkward to fix that to a handle, because all you've got is these two little holes there. I'm uh, going to have to lash it somehow and the end of it is just the flat crossovers so I'm not sure how I'll work that out but there's got to be a way surely to Betsy um, yeah so that's about it just a short one as always from me uh, thanks for watching guys and take care bye bye